how are you? So today, we're going to be playing hobbies. And hobbies are like what you do in the day. If you get bored, you can do a hobby. So talk about your hobbies. Hobbies. I want you guys to talk, tell your mom and dad about your hobbies. Or you can tell me. So now let's get started what, what hobbies we can do. Reading. You can be you guys can do reading books or reading stories. And guys, books and stories, they're the same thing but not spelled. So now writing. Writing poems and writing books. And guys, look here. So I'm going to read you guys this book I made. So this is this can be one of your hobbies by Mila, by me, all about giraffes. And this is a giraffe named Spot. Guys, so now guys, let me read it for you. Wait. So there's a table of contents. Table of contents. Then an introduction. Color lessons. What giraffes eat, spots, what they look like, in conclusion, in glossary. And guys, this like page helps you go to what page you want to go. So you can skip the page. You don't just have to go to the first one. You guys can go to the fourth one or the fifth one. You guys don't have to go to the same pages. But I'm going to read this book for you guys. Introduction. A giraffe walking. Have you ever went to a zoo before? If you have, did you see a giraffe? A giraffe is an awesome animal. Giraffes have cool colors. What else is yellow and brown? So, I want you guys to tell, tell me what else is yellow and brown. So now we're going to read one more page. Oh, and guys, this is color lessons. And guys, before we read here, look right here. Color, colors and patterns. Guys, there's patterns. So that's two colors. There's just one color, so that's one color. And that's the, that's the pattern of a giraffe. Look, that's the giraffe. So now let's read this page. Color lessons. Yellow and brown are two colors. Yellow and brown. A giraffe is yellow and brown. Anything and anywhere can be yellow and brown. Okay, guys. So, uh, that's that's all that I'm going to read for you guys here. But if you guys, if you guys, if you guys ever wrote a book, I would love to see it. I hope, and I would love to see, maybe it's about animals, or maybe it's about you. I would love to see a book about you guys and animals. I love puppies, animals, and other stuff, especially giraffes. That's why I wrote about it. Okay, guys, so now let's go back to where I was. Writing, writing poems, writing books. Playing sports. You guys can play sports as a hobby. Maybe you're bored and you want to play basketball. Play basketball. Shoot the hoops like that. Or if you don't know, maybe you can play tennis. Tennis. You guys can play tennis. I don't know how to play tennis that good, but I'll try. I'm trying to practice though. At least if we practice, we can get better and better. So now soccer. Soccer. You can kick the ball. You can kick the ball. Yes, you can kick the ball. And guys, don't kick it with your front. Kick it with your, like, side. The side of your foot. Kick it with the side of your foot. Not with the front. Because with the front, it won't go faster. It'll go slower. And with the side, you can get it in the goal. Or try your best to get it in the goal. So now, you guys can also go swimming. Because I go, I go swimming. Someone teaches me to, how to swim. They teach me really good. And, and, I have a coach to help me swim. Maybe if you guys swim, 
say you guys have a coach, maybe you can tell your coach your hobby. So now maybe drawing. Drawing is one of my hobbies. I love to draw. I once drew my dad. <laughs> I once drew my dad. It wasn't perfect, but I tried my best. And it was on the phone. I was, I draw, I drew my dad on the phone. On the phone. Swimming, drawing, cooking. My mom cooks delicious food. I love her food. I think she should, she should be a, like a chef. Yeah, people would love her food. I love her food, especially her macaroni and cheese. I love that one. Now sewing, sewing. So basically I think it's like sewing. Maybe you sew. I don't know what this word kind of means, but whatever this word means, I think it's awesome. I think I'll, tr I'll try it myself. So now I'm dancing. I love to dance. I love dancing. <laughs> it's so much fun. You guys can jump like that, and you guys can do like lots of things. Maybe your hobby is dancing. So now, maybe teaching, teaching, driving, teaching and driving, like how I teach you guys. That's one of my other hobbies. I teach you guys because I'm teaching you about explaining hobbies. Now, I want you, and also driving, how my dad and my mom drive. My brother's going to start driving, so I'm just going to teach him how to drive. So now, guys, what else? But guys, wait, I need to know your hobby. What are your hobbies? If you guys let Maybe it should be swimming. Maybe your hobby swimming, drawing, cooking, dancing. I don't, I guys, I don't think you guys can do that. But you might as well cook. You can play. Well, you. What if your mom like tries to make cookies? Maybe you can have fun with the dough and like bake some too. You can help your mom or your dad. My dad helps my mom clean. I don't know what their hobbies are, but like I think about my mom's hobbies cleaning, my dad's hobbies cleaning too, helping my mom, and like my my dad helps me like try to swim, but I also have a coach. So I practice a lot. My family helps me a lot. And guys, I told you my hobbies, and so now it's your turn. What are your hobbies? What are yours? They might as well be dancing, drawing, swimming, or like maybe playing tennis, uh, playing basketball, playing soccer. What's your hobby? My, I'll tell you guys my hobby. I'll tell you guys my hobby. My hobby is swimming. I have tons of hobbies. Swimming, drawing, and also teaching. That's my most favorite hobby. And guys, I also love to dance. And also cooking. I love, and guys, the book. I love this book. It's like awesome. I always read it every single day because this reminds me how my teacher helped me like make this book we tried very hard making this book and guys i guess i'll read you some other pages too just a little bit okay here we go guys, okay, guys so now we learned some of my hobbies so now let's read some of my book so what giraffes eat? Giraffes, giraffes eat acacia trees. Acacia trees are trees that giraffes eat. It keeps them moisturized. They always eat acacia trees for a day. Giraffes eat a lot of leaves. They mostly eat 
if a, a draft guard is standing. Because a draft guard can keep them safe. Spots. Size and colors. They can be big, medium, and small. And that's the, like, how big they can be. Small, medium, like that. Spots are little. Spots on a giraffe, they almost almost have about 50 or 36 spots. Spots are brown. The spots are almost around their whole body. Wow, they have lots of spots. They have 50 or 36 spots. That's a lot. It can cover the whole entire body, maybe. Oh, the guys, look at this giraffe. What they look like. Giraffes have spots and their color is brown and yellow. They have tiny ears that pop up and a nose, but the nose the but the nose doesn't pop up. <laughs> that was funny. Look, guys. They have they have tiny ears that pop up, but the nose does not pop up. So now we're going to read um, one more page. Conclusion. Awesome animal. That's an awesome animal, giraffe. Aren't giraffe awesome animals? Giraffes all have spots everywhere. They talk to others. Whoa, we have learned a lot about giraffes. And guys, this is a glossary. Awesome means something is great. Learn means to get to know something. Tiny means something that's really, really small. Guys, and the, these words are what we had in the book. Hey guys, this, this like writing books is my hobby. This is my hobby. It can be yours too. I'm not worried if you guys have my hobby or like maybe have a different one. All my hobbies are basically, let me tell you some of my hobbies. Swimming, I love, sw these are some of my hobbies. Swimming, drawing, dancing, and I also try to cook with my mom. And um, write, writing books and reading reading books. That's all my hobbies. And I sometimes play soccer. Okay, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And, guys. I hope you liked my book. And, guys. Don't forget to tell me your hobby. Bye.